So, uh, we were left in a situation where we had comp uh, completed our uh, tutorial of the uh, awakening, which is like that's like a big DLC for the for the Dragon Age Origins. Ha have you played a Dragon Age games? By the way, Mistress Wolsey, sent by order of the First Warden at Whiteheart. I'm to act as treasurer of the Arling of Amaranthine. He believed local men could not be trusted for this post. One of those local men is right here, Mistress Woolsey. I have every confidence in the vigil's loyalty in the matter of arms. But gold corrupts even the most resolute sir. Not wise heart itself. I am from many places. I go where the wardens command. Sir, the Arling is on the brink of economic collapse. Trade must flow. Merchant caravans are being systematically attacked somewhere along the Pilgrim's Path. It is the only route that can reliably provision an army, feed a city, and maintain civilization. A short-term thinker sees only immediate financial loss, but without essential supplies, we can expect mass starvation and anarchy. In the city of Amaranthine, there is a trader, Mervis. His caravans have been hit. Surprisingly close. He may know where along the road the dark. This topic uh, to the what happened in Deliver Us Mars. Um. The Ferelden's are a proud people. They are proud of you, especially. Had the first warden sent foreign fighters, it would have caused great distrust amongst the locals. Farrell was specifically chosen as seneschal because he commands great respect here. No, it is far to the north. The fortress is said to be impregnable. It still has the areas where the griffins of old would breed, but their like will never be seen again. About the Arling, he does not. But about the implications, a great deal. When Warden Commander Dryden was cast out of Ferelden generations ago, it created a dangerous precedent. Her true story, and that of the Warden's exile, is one you yourself uncovered at Soldier's Peak. At great personal At that we did. We are now presented with another precedent. Wardens owning lands and commanding fealty from lesser nobles. If your Arling succeeds, it will be an example to other kingdoms that wardens are important, blight or no. Yeah, it's it's on my list. I played a bit at the first one, Dragon Age. Yeah. Very well, Commander. The thing is that this is really this is old game, and this is something that would actually need a remake. Because otherwise, it's there. it's like. Ole sent a dozen wardens to the vigil to await your arrival. Nearly all died in the attack, but Kristoff is still in the field. Okay, so basically, uh, I had lots of issues when I started to record this uh, Dragon Age. Uh, you can actually see most of the uh, video videos are, are at my YouTube page. So uh, this is not the full detail. Not not the graphics are not full because it kind of created uh, issues where. I had to upgrade it to textures, and the memory just went out. So t 32 bits bits of game, so uh, not many. No, the mem memory is actually actually lacking a lot. So this definitely would need a remake. But can we see it some someday? I don't know. The Olesian wardens were uneasy that the it dark would be going awesome, to ground yeah. with the blight ended. Christoph was sent to track down some leads. A fortnight ago, he left in a bustle. As best we figure, he went to the city, Amaranthi. Only so many places travelers visit. I check the inns and taverns. You did, but not to me. The wardens keep their own counsel. And actually, actually watching this uh, awakening it doesn't really spoil much of it, anything because this happens after the Dragon Age story. So this is active. This uh, DLC actually continued the story of the original game. When when uh, whereas uh, many games uh, DLCs just uh, expand the uh, story in, in that game. Wiser men than I have worried over that. One of the wardens said the archdemon's strength gave the horde some semblance of purpose. If they found some other purpose. <sighs> 
That's the only thing that needs immediate attention. Do you want something else, Commander? We call her the Vigil. She's been around for a long spell. They say the Alamari Barbarians first built a fort here to stop Tevinta incursions from the lowlands of the Waking Sea. They say that the castle is built on a mountain of bones. Much death. Nice. As much as you like, sir. Generally, the Keep's Seneschal takes care of day-to-day -day matters. If anything important arises, I'll alert you. As you wish, sir. The Orlesian Wardens were uneasy that the Darkspawn weren't going to ground with the blight ended. Kristoff was sent to track down some leads. A fortnight ago, he left in a bustle. As best we figure, he went to the city. Yeah, I'm already, the... you already, already, already told that. Commander, we, we can this talk is everyone Sir Garrett, here. The new captain of the guard. I have a matter to bring to your attention. Potentially urgent. The Orlesians, Wardens, I mean, began gathering information while they were here. Yeah, Freudian the most promising sleep. lead they found was a wild tale a couple of hunters told. These hunters, Colbert and, well, the other one, claim to have stumbled across an entrance to the deep roads. Darkspawn all over the place, they said. And this was before the fiends appeared throughout the whole Arling. The Wardens were just about to send someone to track down Colbert. Colbert and his friend are in the city of Amaranthine. Probably amongst the refugees outside the city gate. Commander. All right. Point the way, fearless leader. And there's, and there's this actually re recurring character. Nice. And we have full inventory because this game has so small inventory. Can I? Can I actually? Here's my character. We can level up her. So I wonder what wa what was my plan. I actually implemented the duelist. Cripple dual weapon. Yeah, these are new attacks for me. Okay, let's go go that way. I have a uh, and there's an Ogren. So only two characters with me now. And there's has in their mage robes and nothing to head. Yep, you can get that. Couple magical rings, you got the be better axe now. Helm of the Legion, okay, he's wearing Legion armor for some reason. Legion of the Dead, Dwarven, uh, Dwarven uh, detail. And that's, that's how many we have so far. The Tower of Magi has sent me as an ambassador, Commander. In addition to my diplomatic function, I'm a competent enchanter and runesmith. Is there anything you need? Certainly. We can also sell, sell our stuff. Something we don't need because we are kind of swimming on the pointless items.
I don't think we have a golem that we can, could actually use those crystals. Mm. Okay, long sword, not enhanced. Anyway, that's that's going to be. Grey board and helmet. Yeah, I, I didn't bother to get all all set items in a uh, uh, Dragon Age uh, game, so that's why I don't have it. So lots of sets, but I have, I have some something like daily armor that that would be set, but I didn't bother to get it. Just clearing out some space here. There's also these uh, gifts you can actually give to your followers, and this uh, approval it is actually getting better when when you do that. But it depends if they like it. So, Ukraine was kind of guy that, well, all his gifts in uh, Dragon Age were like alcoholic drinks. Okay, so this is actually this is rather neat. But I have better, I think. Yes, I have better. Okay, here he is. Next to the barrel. Need something pummeled? Just say the word. Because why not? Mistress Woolsey says I can set up shop here. The merchant you saved was grateful to be alive. Restock me for a bargain. The savings are yours, of course. You need anything, Commander? Plus four ma willpower and plus four magic. Hmm. Manual shadow. Let's see. That really sounded like nice. Or was this game that you actually needed to save for the upgrades on for the castle and stuff? This 12 gold coins, so let's... Specialization unlock shadow. Okay, now, now I, I can get some... New specializations. <laughs> Kills. A lot. Party. A lot. <laughs> so it... it lot, lots of fighting. Lots of fighting in Dragon Age. So... That, that was... On, most uh, it, it wasn't most welcoming feature in that Do game but anything, the plot was good no. 
I think this could, uh, this ring could actually improve Anders' abilities a lot. Willpower Mage, level up. So willpower is actually more, means more spells, which is definitely what we are going for. He has pretty high magic. Number master herbalism, that would be combat training. And he was arcane war warrior as well, so he can actually use use or armor with with his uh, intelligence number and not the strength. Spirit healer or he healing spells. Fireball would be nice. He has ropes now, so he can get more spell power. But technically, yes, he could he could wear wear the heavy armor. Here we go. Seem it like good thirty thirty five strength. Now I have, I have only two blades here. And this we need to upgrade. And this needs upgrades uh, upgrades at as well. Okay, I'm I'm still missing somebody. But then again we haven't really played this game or that that this DLC a long time so I actually noticed that tower or, or actually remember Blimey, that I noticed the gray. Right. A while back they caught a thief in the vigil. Took four wardens to capture him. Okay. Gave one of the wardens a black eye he did. Half joking they said he might make a good recruit. So basically I remember that uh, I actually bought the awakening first and then the Dragon Age Origins. But I noticed that hey this is actually <laughs> I used uh, started the uh, Xbox and Notice that hey, this is actually a sequel to the fir first game, so I was like, no, maybe I, I bought, will buy the Dragon Age Origins and play it first. He's in the dungeon, sir. I also have some letters arrived just before you did. Just give me a moment. Okay, we need to. Rescue her, uh, rescue his uh, daughter. And there's a dark spawn. Commander, so this is human construction, is it? My brother said you'd need a stonemason, but he didn't know the half of it. That I am. A proper Orzammar Mason. Although, I suppose I'm a surfacer now. The Darkspawn did a number on this keep of yours. But I suspect it was crumbling well before they showed up. 
Your seneschal gave me some fancy decree promising men and monies to fix the vigil, but it's a paltry sum. I suppose it would be sufficient to reconstruct the walls to human standards, but who'd want that? I'm not certain of the character of the stone in these parts, but we'd need more men for certain. Proper skilled men, not some starving dusters, right? Which all boils down to coin, really. Yeah, everything always boils down to how much we, we can use money for the construction. Don't take too long about it. It'll take a while to rebuild, and the dark spawn aren't patient. Okay. So we need to raise some money. Did we have to come all this way? It's cold here. <laughs> At these two. It's not that cold. The wardens have been some of our best customers, and they need us. I miss my shop. This place is so crowded. Defends my sensibility. Ah, Warden Commander. I represent Master Wayne, the finest. And bloody coldest. I can't feel my fingers. <clears throat> finest armorer in Denerum. <laughs> I thought, well, we thought that you might have need of an armorer. My one glittering moment. The highlight of my career. And now I'm stuck at Turnip Keep. Vigil's keep. Vigil! Sorry, Warden Commander. You know how he gets. This is a temporary relocation. The Darkspawn are most active around Amaranthine. We thought we could help. And I suppose the money the Crown paid us had nothing to do with it? Shh! Oh, of course. And then this is the dungeon door. We have a prisoner. We could actually try to recruit. Maybe. Ah, Commander. Good thing you're here. This one's been locked up three nights now. Good men died while this one was protected in his cell. He won't give his name. All I know is he was caught poking around the estate in the middle of the night. I'd say he was just a thief. But it took four Grey Wardens to capture him. You best be careful. Whoever he is, he's no ordinary burglar, that's for sure. As you wish, Commander. I'll tell the Seneschal you came. He'll want to know what you decide to do with this man. If it isn't the great hero, conqueror of the Blight and vanquisher of all evil, aren't you supposed to be ten feet tall with lightning bolts shooting out of your eyes? Somehow, I just thought that my father's murderer would be, uh, more impressive. I am Nathaniel Howe. Ah. My family owned these lands until you showed up. Do you even remember my father? Yes. My father served the hero of Riverdane and fought against the Orlesians, yet our family lost everything. I came here. I thought I was going to try to kill you, to lay a trap for you. But then I realized I just wanted to reclaim some of my family's things. It's all I have left. That was the plan. Look, I know you're a hero. You fought a war and you won, and to the victor go the spoils, right? Whatever my father did, however, shouldn't harm my whole family. The house are pariahs now. Those of us left. It's all thanks to you. And now you get to decide my fate. Ha! Ironic, isn't it? You're right. I'll go join King Alistair's service immediately. He'd be certain to give a how another chance. The Darkspawn are a menace. If it weren't for the Blight, maybe my father would never have done what he did. But I can't do anything about them, can I? There's just um, you and the well. Grey Wardens here in my home. The house served Ferelden for 12 generations. 
My ancestors served under King Callanhad, and now it's all lost. So go ahead and do what you're going to do. If you let me go, I don't know. I only came back to Ferelden a month ago. If you let me go, I'll probably come back here. You might not catch me next time. I'm not without skills. My time abroad wasn't spent chasing skirts and drinking wine. Hunting, scouting, poisons. Why? What do you care? Apparently, Hope already <laughs> gave a good, uh, good education for his son. I brought the Seneschal for you, Commander. I see you've spoken to our guest. Quite the handful, isn't he? Have you decided what's to be done with him? Not really. <laughs> I wish to invoke the right of cons conscription. Yes. You what? I'm sorry, Commander. The right of conscription on the prisoner. Well, he, he no, has done absolutely before. Absolutely not. Hang me first. You really want to how as a grey ward? You are a very strange woman. I can't decide if this is a vote of confidence or punishment. It's both. An interesting decision, Commander. Come with me, sir. We'll see if you survive the journey. So he is probably a rogue. From this moment forth, Nathaniel Howe, you are a grey warden. The moment of truth. The how is stronger than I expected. For better or for worse, he will live. Probably going to... But it's possible there are still darkspawn in the vigil. Okay, that's not good. Let me explain. You know Dwarkin? That mad dwarf's bombs shook the whole keep. Some of the deep cellars caved in. I suspect that there are pockets of darkspawn below, trapped. In time, they may dig their way out. We'll station guards and hope the darkspawn can't burrow out. Straight away, sir. All right, we have rats, and we need to clean them. Clean them out. Here we are. The vigil goes deep, real deep. The hallways down here have been crumbling for years and decades, and that blasted Dwarkin's explosives didn't do the structure any favors. You heard the commander. Put your backs into it. This is where you come in. Who knows what's up ahead? We'll be back here. <laughs> Fun, fun. You're Rendon Howe's little blighter. That's one way of putting it. They talked about you in the army. Fergus Kuzlin said you wouldn't have the stones to show your face again. But you proved him wrong. I respect that. You do? Yeah. Throw caution to the wind. Run headlong into danger. And sod the consequences. That's the only way to live. Thanks. I think. Yep. Don't you give a pick. It's what the others think. I've got your back. <laughs> He's a berserk. It is begun. Doggy. She was... she was like a mother to me. We must save her. 
No, okay. Works for me. I'd better see if you please. That's in the cellar. How Ukraine was was under the spell and now he's so kind of deep frozen. This, this looks like a boss fight. Very well. Scene, really. Key of Kifel. Trickster's cap. Okay. Plus 15 mental resistance, plus 15 physical resistance. So that's away from the damage. I think Trickster's cap actually fits to Anders best. I shall do it.
Okay, Ogren. You could go from the stand stand aside, and Anders can actually throw deep freeze all these skeletons. And there's more coming. Yep. Nathaniel definitely needs more skills, but... <laughs> Those guys are very actually stuck to the stairs here. Okay. No problem when you actually have a experienced characters and Hopo Nathaniel can actually get this. Get this item that belonged to he, uh, his uh, ancestors. Is this what I think it is? Uh, it's a bow. It is. That's the how crest burned into the wood right there. This is my grandfather's bow, or rather, my grandfather was the last to use it. It was originally made for an ancestor during the exalted marches not broken I heard that only a how can enable the enchantment I remember finding it before father sent me to the free marches a shame for it to sit in storage thank you it's good to have a part of my family's legacy again something to be proud of peculiar There must be some way. A dryer. Darkspawn men. 
well. You hear the stories about you and the wardens. But to see it firsthand. Oh, they did too. Even though the attack was a surprise, they killed droves of Darkspawn. Just ask the poor maids who have to clean it up. But you, you're something else. Anyway, it looks like the explosives caved this section in. I brought along Master Voldrick. So, this is how you humans ply your stonecraft. Disgraceful, that is. What, this would barely last a few centuries. I wager these passages may go far enough to connect to the deep roads. I, your Elysian lads would have had a terrible surprise. Explains how experienced men fell to the Darkspawn. This is a grave matter. If we don't shut these tunnels, the Darkspawn can attack from below again. And trust his blood, there are basement entrances throughout the keep. There's no way to defend against that. Then we follow the tunnels and hope to find a single point to block off. Never you fear, lads. With the Warden's muscle in my stonecraft, we'll find a way. We'll need some time, but as soon as we clear it, we'll let you know. Of course. Yeah, here's some ore. You're back. You need anything? <laughs> this will help a great deal. Viridium. Armor and weapons could be made with this. Commander, if you like, we could outfit your men. It wouldn't cost you anything, but some soldiers would have to guard the miners. So I'm to make armor for all Amaranthine's rabble? Helen, you abuse me so it's unconscionable. Commander's orders. Fine, fine, I'll work. But I want a challenge one day. Something to sink my teeth into. 